Alright, hey guys, m 12 4 dog here, back with another video, and today, we are continuing our playthrough of, uh, Halo Combat Evolved, and I'm starting off by going gun crazy, by going a little gung-ho and nade, grenade crazy, or grenade happy, whatever you want to call it. And I'm using a pistol because, for whatever reason, I find this to be much better than the assault rifle. And it has much better range than it. I don't know. I just think this is, like, one of my favorite pistols of all time in a video game. And you want to know what? You can disagree with me, and I'm okay with that. We can have a chat about that if you want in the comments below on this video. Which, by the way, if you... Haven't already? Feel free to leave some comments, questions, or feedback for me. Uh, seeing as I have a very small audience, I pretty much can. Any reasonable questions, I will answer. Um, if they're inappropriate in any way, I will not, but, uh... That's okay. I think they seem to... Most people who do this seem to directly DM me on Twitter. But other than that, I guess I'm okay. Ow! Where are you? They seem to have the entire region secured. Entire region? Why would they want the entire region secured? I don't know. We'll find out. Oh, hey, bridge. I wonder if we can actually feel how cold it is outside in our armor. Our team Zulu. Now, for those of you who don't know, this is one of this is like an old classic game that I will still love to play, and I've played through the whole thing before, but I've never done a playthrough on it on my channel, um, except for what you've seen so far. So I haven't like, but I have played through this, um, and there's something I think I feel will come up soon. I don't remember. Oh my god, I fell down. I thought I fell off the map, to be honest. Oh my god. Woo! Here, eat a grenade. I said eat a grenade, not dodge it. How dare you? Is it too much to ask for you to eat a grenade? Preferably without the safety pin in? Apparently it is. Great! And I'm out of pistol ammo. Not surprised. No, in my luck, I'll walk all the way back here under... What? Oh, I, I directly meleeed him, and yet he still survived. Now, though, alright. No, in my luck, there's probably gonna be some sort of pistol back here. That I can get anyway. Any pistol ammo? Nope. Probably not. I'm stuck with the assault rifle for now. So I take it all glass on this kind of bridge will break. So I gotta be careful with my movements from now on. I was about to say... I guess the grenades do not break the glass, but then I realized the glass was already broken there. Glass here is not broken. If I wanted someone to take fall damage, that's how I do it. Why don't you come over here? He's just playing a coward's game because that guy knows that he can only beat me in close combat with that energy sword. Yes! You pretty much have to nade and run when it comes to that.
What? How the F did I? He like did not shoot or any how did I die? I, I don't even know. Great, I'm officially low on ammo on both things. Oh well. When I get low on ammo, I'm probably just gonna kill a, an elite, and then, uh, when I get really low, and then, uh, like, less than a clip, and then I'll swap. Unless I can restock on ammo. Which I would love to do right now. What the? Invisible? Freak? Alright. Oh, crap. That's kind of hard to do. They're, like, they were attacking from multiple directions, the grunts, which I don't mind. It was the, uh, whatchamacallit, the invisible guys. I had trouble dealing with. Can only come from the front now. Are they gonna come after me? I'm looking over my computer. I'm so glad the thing did not pick that up. All right. I have seemed to perfectly mastered the noise gate. And what it need the volume and the which it needs to be at. Although I cannot say that if if I had my uh, window unit turned on because I have like a window unit thing for air conditioning. It's great because I can turn it on and off right when I want to instead of leaving my room. It's actually kind of good because if I want to... Oh my god, I found pistol ammo. Because if I want to go and, you know, turn it on and keep it real nice and cool, but turn it off when I think it's getting too cold, I can. And then just leave my room and go, go to a console thing and just press 20 buttons for it. Plus our central air conditioning thing is not working at the moment anyway. So, I don't know. Seems pretty good. Got him there. All right. Now where do I go? Is this back? Nope, this is not back the way I came. All right, let's see you down here. Anything? No. Long hallway. Nope. Activate lift. <laughs> All right. Apparently, I still do not know I'm here. I might as well get some free melee kills. In the meantime. My first surprise skill where I made my presence known was on an elite, which is kind of good. Because if you have to worry about a bunch of jackals and uh, runts in your first kill, right off the bat, is an elite that's usually pretty good in my in my book. I call that a win. Alright. Ow!
right, let's go here. Is this the way we came? Nope, we're getting a checkpoint. I guess not. All right. Wow. I'm putting that... That was an epic fail right there. Oh my god. Just throw the grenade and don't approach it. Okay, I guess not. Taking fire... Guess we're still alive! Hey! Soldier! Hop on! We got some u enemies to shoot. We got about five seconds before that thing gets a lock on us. Hurry up and get on. That was a little too close for comfort. Now, right now, I'm just going to drive around in circles and kill all these guys. That way, we don't have to worry about them later on. I have no freaking clue where that uh, Wraith is firing from. Oh, I see it. I mean, if I was a smart person, I wouldn't take a rocket launcher. I mean, it'd be kind of hard to fire at the thing if it's constantly moving. Which is true. Just like our warthog is. But! <clears throat> let's just... Yes! I destroyed it with the plus grenade. Well, as I was saying... That if I keep moving, or something like that, that I would uh, end up uh, making it it'd be easier, it would be harder for us to hit the thing, which is true, but I would, but the way I think is that I see a wraith on the ice, and I wouldn't shoot the wraith, I'd shoot the ice and hope it falls in, because it just hovers above it, and I don't know if we can hover above water, and, then, and that would be kind of cool, because I don't think I've ever seen it hover above water. Well, deep water, that is. I mean, it's probably... On uh, certain Halo 4 maps, I've seen it, like, uh... Whatchamacallit, uh... Well, there's no going back now. That's not in this vehicle, that is. Oh, hey! A scorpion! In the M808... Main battle tank. Scorpion main battle tank. Whatever you want to call it. Uh, yeah, whatever. I know. Hop on! Oh, give us a ride to victory. The gunner does not want to get off. Oh well. I guess I'm only gonna have two guys with me. Does not matter really though. I definitely do not want them using that ghost. Well, so. Wait, what? Apparently I killed someone according to, um. Um, I can't fire at targets too close, though. With the main cannon, though. Alright.
Blew that thing into a bajillion pieces. All right. What am I thinking? I'm trying to fire at this guy. I don't know why they're hopping on the tank, though. It's kind of dangerous. The cannon is right there. If I have to fire at something close to it. If anything, they should be fall. They should be uh, moving 50... Would be within, like, 50 feet behind me, and that's about it. Rip. Apparently the wraith exploded, killing me. I don't know. Maybe I fired at it by accident when it was that close. Enemy motor, tank at my motor tanks. I guess you could call it a motor tank. It has arcing fire. Apparently, that was not a good idea, either. I see a tank, and, like, my main objective is to blow the crap out of that thing. That's probably not the best thing to do. Maybe I should stay at a distance and do it. This thing takes forever to reload. Chances are pretty low that I'm actually going to find a, uh... And I'm gonna actually going to find a health kit here. Apparently, for whatever reason, my thing wasn't backing up. Oh, the machine gun on this thing is going to be great as AA. Then again, I just take it out with the main cannon here. This arcing fire can fire me from a position that I can't hit it at. It doesn't matter. Ooh, it's over here now. Or it was. I don't know. Anyway, I'm done. I'm just gonna go continue on. Where are we going now? All right. So I had to get out of the tank for that one. No, let's crash this party here. And there's some covenant party going on. Now, I have a thing about that, and that is that it must come to an end. fire at that thing.
Apparently that thing is not destruct is indestructible, not destroyable, whatever you want to call it. It's kind of annoying because I aim my marker right on it, a reticle, and it does not get destroyed. Not good enough. There. I mean, fall off. Which means that they can't even, uh, reuse it anymore. Because it's gone now. It fell into the pit. I need a medkit so bad right now. Bet if I go out and wander around for a while, I'll find one. That thing's not being used anymore. What's this? Oh, that's just a dead, uh... Nope, I thought that guy was dead, but apparently not. Alright. Nothing here, let's continue on. So also I'm moving, and I'm like, is that an elite? If I did not hold back, I probably would have... wrecked them. Alright. Let's continue on. Rolling Thunder. This is the part where I think they want me to get out of my vehicle? What? How did I die, like, instantaneously? Means to transition to the third chasm. Apparently, we went through two others, apparently. All right. Not bad. Uh, okay. I think what, what happened last time was I fired at the rock directly in front of me. And ended up blowing myself up. Can I destroy the dropship with the tank? I'm thinking it's possible. I mean, it makes sense that it would, but if did they make did they allow for that to be possible though? Is really what I'm asking. Where is it? Probably not up there. Could be. All right. Maybe it is. No, no. Well, I'm definitely not letting them use that. 
all bunched together right at the exit there. It's not good because they're just blowing that up. Yeah! Why are you shooting at me? How'd you like it if I did that to you? And you're, it's not, and apparently tanks are indestructible. Human vehicles are apparently indestructible. It's whether or not the damage that the player takes. So apparently you don't destroy the vehicle. If you kill the player inside, that's what counts. Which to me does not make sense. You would think at least me being in this heavy vehicle would provide some protection. They don't even mark this as an enemy. So I'm going to say no. I probably can't get rid of it. At two with that shot. I guess I was just real freaking lucky. All right. Come on. And that happens. Well, on a string of epic fails, I guess that's where I'm going to end this video here. Hope you guys enjoyed watching. If you did, take the time to leave any comments, questions, or feedback for me in the comment section down below. It would be highly appreciated. And I will see you guys later in another video. Bye-bye.